Well, we know that many in Brussels were very, very worried, very worried indeed about the outcome of the Polish election. They were hoping that the Law and Justice Party in power would be ousted and that Donald Tusk would come to power in Poland. Well, the results are now in and the results are not dissimilar in scenario to what you saw in Spain. So the biggest overall winner uh, in terms of a single party, in terms of support in this election, was the Conservative Law and Justice Party. However, what has happened is that as a combination, the civic coalition with Donald Tusk, uh, the liberal third way and the new left, it seems, have got enough support with the Law and Justice Party losing support since the last election that these three opposition parties now, it looks like, are going to be able to take power and will have Donald Tusk become the next Polish Prime Minister. On top of that, of course, I reported on the Law and Justice Party uh, calling on a multiple question referendum on the same day as the election, where what happened was the opposition parties, opposition voters boycotted that referendum. So the referendum vote didn't get to 50% turnout and thus is not binding. But it may not be smooth sailing ahead because you do still have the Polish President Duda, an ally of the Law and Justice Party, still in place. As for the likely incoming coalition for Poland, where you've got Ben Stanley, a political scientist in Warsaw there, commenting that it won't be an easy coalition to hold together at the best of times, and these won't be the best of times. We will now see if this likely incoming coalition, uh, led by Donald Tusk, can survive. As ever, I will keep bringing you all the latest on this and more, of course. So please do whack this video a quick thumbs up. And of course, as ever, cheers for watching.